Donors Choose is a crowdsourcing site designed exclusively for teachers. They take the integrity of their site very seriously, and so only teachers that are verified as K-12 educators in a public school are eligible to apply. However, if you're not yet a teacher or you do not work in a public school, it's still a really valuable experience to go through their process of applying for a Donors Choose project, and it will help you understand the basics of grant writing. Here is what you will experience. First, you will log in. If you are creating your first account, consider looking at who some of their partners are. This is something that you can go back and review on a regular basis. Next, you will pick a project type. They are limited based on how many applications you have made and which earns you points. For example, when you pick your project type, you can use one to four points to request materials. Your first grant through Donors Choose can only be up to $400. Next, you will go shopping. Lots of different companies, including Amazon, Staples, and Lakeshore Learning, are included. You'll use their shopping basket that is provided in order to select the items that you wish to use. Go out to the site and then come back with your final cart. Summarize your cart, what you're purchasing, and why you need it. Start with My Students Need, as prompted by the text box. Tell your story. Pay attention to the number of characters allowed. You can use a word processor in order to prepare your responses so that you can use the tools of character count. So the first question will ask you to summarize your classroom by answering the following prompts, but you must do it in just 300 characters. Next, you'll be asked to tell more about your students. You'll have up to 1,000 characters to make this description. Tell how the students will use the materials you're requesting. You have a thousand characters to do this, but think about what they'll be able to do and what they will learn. Close by telling how the materials will make a difference. How will it improve the classroom? How will it improve the student experience? You will be presented with a series of selection buttons. What kind of materials are you requesting and what is your grade level? Other materials as to the need level of your school district are filled out when you create your account. At this point, you'll be asked to upload a picture and to give your project a title, and then you can choose to save or submit. Once submitted, it will go through a review process by Donors Choose. During the review, they will keep in touch via email. Once it goes live on their site, you can share your Donors Choose project via social media, email, newsletters, and other sources.